hello youtube welcome back to my channel vicks backyards chicks for another video today i'm going to be reviewing the easter egger breed of chicken um that is our white fluffy girl that you just saw pecking on the other girls enjoy these photos of her growing up i made a little video and photo contemplation so you can kind of see how she progresses as she gets older she is so cute and so sweet so Easter Eggers are actually a mixed breed chicken. Um, they are a chicken that is mixed with an Americana or Aracana chicken. Easter Eggers typically have that pea-sized comb. As you can see, Bunny has more of a small comb at the top of her head versus a larger comb like the other girls. You'll see that here in these photos coming up. So that is what a pea comb means to any new chicken owner. So it's a small comb at the top of their head versus having a large floppy one like you might see on some roosters or some other chicken breeds. They will also have a typically have a fluffy beard. Most Easter eggers you'll notice have that fluffy beard or fluffy cheeks. It is the cutest thing, especially on those little uh, chick photos that you saw earlier. So they have some characteristics of those Americana or Aracana chickens. Um, Easter Eggers come in all different shades and different feather patterns depending on what they're mixed with. So that's very cool. Oftentimes you will see um, the white ones like Bunny is here, like she's sunbathing. You'll see the white ones. They also are brown. I've seen dark gray. I've seen all different types of colors. So it is kind of like a mutt chicken as you could say um, but from my experience easter eggers are very sweet bunny has been so nice with us and we love her so just how their bodies can come in various colors um, their eggs actually can come in various colors specifically with bunny here we were told she would give us blue or green eggs because she was crossed with an americana so our breeder already knew what eggs that she was most likely going to lay. But fun fact is Easter Eggers could lay pink eggs, brown eggs, blue eggs, green eggs, depending on whatever they are mixed with. So once you find out what egg they are laying, that is the same color leg they will lay throughout their entire lifetime. Um, lucky for us with Bunny, we got the green green blue egg we were expecting this is the first egg she ever laid a torpedo type egg it was funny but that was the first egg she ever laid um easter eggers do take a little bit longer to start laying they typically lay um at about 20 to 25 weeks old about five to six months um Ooh. bunny did end up laying at about six months old we it took her forever we were anticipating that first egg we thought maybe she was laying brown eggs but it turns out those are from our other ladies she did in fact lay that blue egg that you saw you'll see some more photos as well they do lay about four ish eggs per week about 200 to 280 eggs per year um, I will say their temperament is very kind. Um, it obviously depends on how they're raised or if you handle them a lot. But um, the Americanas and Aracanas mix are very nice, docile breeds. Bunny is super sweet. I can handle her very easily. I do call her our loner chicken. Um, she kind of tends to stay to herself. And she did get a little bit picked on for a while there, but she holds her own ground and she has been so great. They are known to be hardy uh, breeds, so they do well in the summers as well in the winters. For Bunny, I noticed she does a lot better in the cooler temperatures than she does in the heat. She does tend to pant in the summer, but here in Texas, it gets very hot in the summer. So I do give them extra water to put their feet in, sometimes ice cubes or ice water so they can drink that or put their feet in it. I will say that I have noticed when it gets super hot outside, she is the first of my breeds to start panting, which is not a good sign for your chicken. But just as an FYI, overall, they are known to be pretty hardy in all temperatures. While I was saying earlier is Bunny is so sweet and kind, Easter Eggers are known to be docile 
um, sweet and also very curious birds. They like to explore and I can confirm that with Bunny. She loves to explore. With that being said, make sure you give your Easter Egger plenty of space to roam around or let them free range in a safe manner. Um, do, they don't do well in confinement. While I don't believe you should be keeping your chickens in super small areas, just keep that in mind that they don't do well in confinement. I do notice also that she does love to eat um, in the morning. She is pretty loud. Here she is walking out of our automatic door. They are pretty loud, and um, if they're low on food, she will let me know. Here you can see her bright blue egg compared to all the others. And that's all I have to say for the Easter Egger. I hope you'll have a fantastic day. Thank you so much for watching my video. Leave any comments below for any questions. I am more than happy to answer. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.